Hi, today we're going to learn how to improvise some blues on the piano with just the right hand. Okay, first things first, we need to learn the blues scale. Okay, so I'm just going to play the blues scale with, with just one finger. So this is middle C, that'll be the first note. And then we've got E flat, F, uh, G flat, G, and B flat, and then back to C. I'm going to play it backwards now. C, B flat, G, G flat, F, E flat, and C. Okay, before we improvise with the right hand, we'll need something um, to play along to. So one thing we can do is record uh, our left hand playing separately. Okay, so if we just play a simple shuffle on the piano, and we can record this. Okay, so I'm going to play that back. I can jam along with my right hand now. Okay, the other thing we can do is go into uh, YouTube and find uh, find a backing track. So I've typed in blues jam track in C. Let's see what we get. I found this one. So this one is a BB King style. Okay, so before we start to jam, um, we need a little musical idea that which we can develop. So I'm going to just use two notes. Obviously we've got one, two, three, four, five, six notes to choose from, but I'm just going to work with two. I'm going to use the C, our root note, and then the minor third, the E flat. So my first phrase is going to be this, just going to play C, E flat, and then C, two Cs. And I can develop that a little bit more and go, add an extra C at the beginning. And then I can develop it again, it's a bit like Chinese whispers, we change it a little bit each time. I was going to get a little bit boring using two notes for the for the whole sequence, so I'm going to go up to the F this time. Okay, so we're just changing it a little bit each time. Made a little bit of a longer phrase there. Now I'm going to go for my blue note this time, which is the the G flat. Blue 
note though, the G flat. Now the G. Okay, let's talk about crush notes then. So the crush note we're going to use is the G flat to the G. Now, some of you may be wondering what I'm going on about a crush note. If we play them together, it, it sounds pretty uh, sounds pretty terrible. So what we're going to do is kind of play them very close together. So if you've just slide from the G flat onto the G, just slide down the keys quickly that's the kind of effect we want so we're going to try and add in some of those to our solo now flat as well now okay we're gonna add some double stops now so um What's a double stop, you may ask? Well, uh, double stop is when we play two notes of the scale together. So I'm going to I'm going to choose the G and the B flat. Now we want to just do this on our root chord, which is the C major chord or C7. We can't do it on the G or the F because it won't it won't fit. So we could just throw in, and we've got the crush notes as well. So we've got a few tools to use now. Okay, so we've been stuck in the, in the same octave up until now, which are going from uh, middle C to the C above middle C. So what we're going to do is try the second octave. So this is the... So if I zoom out a bit, I've got two octaves now.
there we have it. We've created uh, quite an impressive sounding solo out of just six notes and a few different techniques. So uh, I hope you've enjoyed playing the blues as, as much as I do. And I'll see you next time. Bye.